Hello kids. It is, uh, as you can tell, very rainy today. That's why there was no rambling while ambling. <laughs> Apparently on Sunday, I'm going to be discussing politics with First Amendment tests. I don't particularly know why he wants to discuss politics with me. Maybe he just really enjoys it. Um, maybe he just wants to test me on it. I, who knows? But hey, we're discussing politics. And uh, we're going to see what common ground we have and, and where we differ. And if we can reasonably accept the differences in opinions. Politics are a weird thing. Um, I don't, I, I love politics. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love politics, but I love politics in the uh, watching football kind of way. People are inherently tribalist. I mean, maybe you've seen that, that in my comments or in the comments of other auditors where you get the people who think the police can do no wrong and you get the people who think the auditors can do no wrong. And they just can't understand each other. And then you get people like me who point out when the police are wrong. And when I do that, I must I must love the auditors. <clears throat> and when I point out the auditors are wrong, I must love the police. Tribalistic people can't understand their own tribalism. Generally speaking, hashtag not all. And uh, those aren't the people that I try to get through to, ever. I mean, you make, you make an attempt, because sometimes, like, at one point in time, I was tribal about it, you know? I went, actually, I went really tribal. I grew up really, really, really right-wing. When I went to college, I swung over pretty left-wing. I mean, about halfway left. And then as I've grown older, I've kind of narrowed down to center. I, I am actually your classic social liberal relig or, uh, religious don't careist and uh, con fiscal conservative. Anyway, yeah, politicians also don't really care about their base. They they care about their base during the primary when they when they need the votes of their base to get the nomination but then you'll see they swing they're not they're not trying to move their base Trump moved his base slightly or he changed where his base was I don't know if any of you remember but uh, he got people to um, applaud uh, gay and lesbians and, and include them in uh, the very right wing conservative areas of the party, which, I mean, there have always been like the log cabin Republicans, but that was pretty, that was pretty bold. That was actually a shift of the base. So, you know, I applaud him. That's, that's like almost impossible to do. It's, it's as hard to shift the base as it is to convince the auditor supporters that auditors are being assholes or cop supporters that cops are being assholes. It's hard to do. But anyway, so on uh, on Sunday, he is an auditor and I have, I guess, interviewed him before. Um, but apparently we are going to, it's not going to be an interview, we're going to discuss politics. So it'll be interesting to see what what he wants to bring up. Because yes, I'm leaving it to him. I'll take I'll take the opposite of pretty much whatever position he wants to bring up. Because that's always fun. Who knows? Who knows? It should be fun. Anyway, uh, don't expect anything today. Uh, as far as like, obviously rambling while ambling. I wouldn't really expect anything tomorrow. I think it's going to rain again tomorrow. But we'll see. We'll see. Play it by ear. Oh, uh, keep your eye out. Apparently, uh, 
uh, Chauncey has a big video coming out today. He's going to uh, he's going to expose me, so keep your eye out on that. Uh, yeah, that's about it. I I still haven't been served with a lawsuit from anybody. I still haven't been uh, disciplined or contacted by the bar. Uh, I still haven't been fired. Nobody's shown up to uh, to beat me up on my morning walks. It's it's almost like all these things are all talk and no action. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you guys have a, a lovely day.